Hey guys, if you're new to our channel, I'm JC. And I'm Casey. And today we are going to tell you guys the story of how I got my puppy. If you guys didn't know, I got a puppy and I posted him on TikTok and Instagram so far. Yep, it's a shock to everyone. <laughs> and now he's gonna be on YouTube and we're gonna show you guys my puppy later, but I'm going to talk about it a little bit first because I've been getting a lot of comments on my TikTok and Instagram about how I betrayed Teddy and oh my goodness, how could you do that to your other dog? So I just kind of wanted to go over that a little bit. Basically, our parents are divorced and Teddy used to live with us when we were a complete family and my dad fell in love with Teddy and we couldn't really have him here because we were in school all the time. We weren't always there to hang out with him. So we decided to just give Teddy to our dad and our dad is completely obsessed with Teddy and Teddy's emotionally attached to our dad. Yes, so we barely see Teddy, like we see him on occasions. Whenever we visit our dad, we get to see him and when I try and bring Teddy over to our house for like a sleepover or something, he gets like separation anxiety, he cries and he's just in a really yeah, bad way. He misses our dad. He misses our dad always. So I don't really feel as if Teddy's like my dog anymore i feel like he's more so my dad's dog and he was a really good anxiety reducer for me every time i was with him i felt at ease and if you guys don't know i deal with very bad anxiety issues i just don't know where they came from i just have a lot of those issues i get panic attacks once in a while and i feel like i deal with anxiety on a daily basis and so I decided for my mental health and just because I really wanted one, I would get a puppy. And let me just say, it's been like a couple days of having him and I've already felt so much better. I feel distracted, I feel at ease, and he's just so much fun. Because animals just make you happy. They do, they're just very enjoyable and they bring and a lot of- And they're so cute. Yes, they are cute. And they bring a lot of like peace in my life for some reason. I don't know if that makes sense, but Teddy used to bring so much peace in my life, but now that he's kind of my dad's dog, it doesn't really feel the same. I don't know, it's just hard because we don't really see him as much. We've never had a puppy before because when we got Teddy, he was four years old. He was basically trained for the most part. And this puppy is the complete opposite. He is three months old, almost three months, I guess. And he is not really trained. I mean, he knows how to go on a pad. He's trained in that manner, but like he doesn't know his name yet. He bites everything. He chews his toys. He chews the couch. He chews my hair all the time. My hair too. Yeah. I remember he went in my room and I was on my computer and he just stood on my computer. Like he came mm -hmm. up and stood on it. He's a baby though. Like he's still <laughs> getting to understand what he can and can't do. And he's very fun. He is. All right guys. So it's time to meet the puppy. <laughs> and we decided that his name is going to be Buddy. I was like debating if I could name him chicken or it like took nugget. A while. Mm -hmm. He looks like a chicken nugget to me. So I really wanted to name him like chicken nugget. <gasps> He's biting me. <laughs> yeah, that's what he does. He loves to bite like fingers and we need it's to teach him not It's not that bad though. Look, he's literally biting my finger. <laughs> Little silly dog. We get him toys every time he does that and he likes the fingers more than the toys. Well, like, he does really like his toys. Yeah. Like look, he's biting. <laughs> he's a very fun puppy, very playful, but he also sleeps a lot. Like He's tiny. Like hold him up to the camera sideways so they can see. Like this is look, how wide he is. Look how tiny. <laughs> This is how short. He is He's so light. Good. Look how tiny his paws are. He <laughs> so is cute. three pounds almost right now, and he's only supposed to be six pounds. That means he's not gonna get a lot bigger than this. He's uh -oh. going to be like puppy size forever. Just a little heavier. Buddy is very friendly. He likes other dogs and he loves people. He always like jumps on people. He doesn't bark. People. No, he doesn't bark, but he does cry when I put him away in his cage for a little bit. He gets a little sad because I think he misses us, but um, he met Teddy. Yeah, he and did. That was really funny. They were really playful with each other. I always thought Teddy was this tiny little dog until I met Buddy. <laughs> and I just think like next to each other, it shows how small this dog really is. Mm -hmm. Cause Teddy is really small to begin with. I know. Teddy was just annoyed of him cause all this puppy wanted to do is play. <laughs> and and jump on him. older and he just wanted to sleep and calm down and not do what this puppy does. 
He likes to scramble. Everyone's been commenting what breed this dog is. He is a Yorkie Poo, and when I was looking for puppies, I really didn't want to get another Yorkie per se, because that's what Teddy is, and I don't think any dog will ever live up to what Teddy was for me. He was like my best friend, and I could never get another Yorkie, because it just would not be the same. So I wanted to have a different experience with a different dog breed. Oh my gosh, he's holding his paw. <laughs> okay, I'm putting him down. But yeah, I needed to get a different dog. I needed to name him something different. I couldn't name this dog Teddy. That Even though like... we wanted to call him Teddy. Yeah, every time I would call him, I would say Teddy by accident because I'm just so used to that with my yeah, dog. Yeah, but now you're not. Yeah. Now it's Buddy. It's really sad to think about that I guess Teddy might feel left out now, but he has been living with our dad. He doesn't really live with us anymore. Yeah, we do show him a lot, so that might be reasons why people thought he yeah. still lived with us. Because we post of him all the time. On TikTok. So whenever we're with him, we post because... Well, you do. Yeah, I do. Because <laughs> I just am obsessed with dogs, and Teddy will always be my childhood dog. This is so sad because <laughs> he's literally not our dog anymore. We still visit Teddy all the time and another thing that I wanted to talk about is if I wanted Teddy back I couldn't really take him from my dad like I just would feel horrible doing that because they're so attached <laughs> and I really needed to bring a an emotional support dog to college with me and I could not bring Teddy I just could not do that so that's mm -hmm. why I also had to get another puppy because Buddy's going to be coming to college with me and now I'm gonna be even more sad when she leaves because she's taking Buddy with her yes you are going to be sad. You're going to miss both of us now. <laughs> and he's a really good dog for the dorms because he doesn't cry or bark that much. And he's just not hard to take care of. I want to hold him. Okay. So this is Buddy, everyone. I'm really glad you all get to meet him. And if you want to know more about him, you can leave us questions on our Instagram or my Instagram, at officiallyjc. And I could do a puppy tag maybe on my own channel. He is so much fun and he like is crazy with me. He's so like content with her and then look at him. <laughs> he wants to get away from you. Hey! hey. Buddy. Also on my new channel, I'm probably going to be posting a lot of videos with him. He's so much fun and he's like a new big part of my life. I mean, I'm going to have him for hopefully a while. Hopefully like 15 years. I hope he lasts <laughs> that long. But he's going to meet my kids one day, hopefully. Yay. And yeah, he's so cute, so fluffy. He's like a teddy bear. I also made him an Instagram. It's literally the same as ours, officially buddy with two <laughs> Y's at the end. So cute. Mmm, buddy's so cute. We hope you guys enjoyed meeting our new little family member. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and please share with your family and your friends. And if you're new to our channel or haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time. We love you so much. Bye.